Hello everyone, and welcome back to the second video of the Astroneer series. Uh, if you've seen the last video, you'll know what's going on. And of course, if this is the first video you're watching, you don't remember all of this, of course you don't, because we've built this in the last video. So, but you've probably seen the last video. Anyway, you've probably read the title, and if you've watched the last part of the video, you would know what we're going to be doing today. Uh, the little speed video that I did, I was doing this for a good 20 to 30 minutes, and we have made 6,800 research bites. Uh, these research bites is actually a very important thing, and those are a lot of research, research bites to get off our feet. As you can see, these are important things, and they don't cost too much compared to our bites. We're going to have enough if we don't spend it on everything. You're going to need, like... Uh, so much if you want to be serious and unlock everything at least a hundred thousand I'm gonna say so maybe uh, five hours at least five hours dedicated to resource gathering for the little balls and uh, going in the caves picking up bites nonetheless we have the bites so First things first is going to be the most important things. This, very nice but not important right now. So, alright, we already have the soil centrifuge, that's good. We're going to need the chemistry lab and the atmospheric condenser. Also, this platform would be very nice. It's probably in this. Alright, there you go. Two aluminum. Very expensive. And you see how much bites we have left? Uh, <laughs> that took such a long time, too. Alright, where is it? We are going to need power, so. Not that, not that. This. Very nice. And that should be about it. I'll explain what those things are. Okay. So, this thing. The thing I just researched, the, the wind, the small winter mark. You see these uh, white streaks in the air? That is wind. And if it is windy, then the little wind turbine spins. And if the wind turbine spins, then it powers up this battery that we have. And it can provide more electricity to whatever we're running here. The solar panel, you guessed it. If it's sunny out, sun out, this thing will power also the battery. I'm pretty sure that it, it distributes the same amount of power as the wind turbine, but I've never run that experiment, so I can't be... Uh, that, that's not for certain. Anyway, those resources are going to take a bit of time to gather, and in today's video, that is what we're going to be doing. So, we are going to have to either make a hole or find a cave to look into. And the best way of doing that is to have a tether bundle with you to supply yourself with oxygen. I'm going to drop off these. Put that in there. Alright. And by the way, when you place down things, they stay in the same area. They don't despawn. They don't fling off the map. Unless you make them. So. 
Just keep that in mind. Because I know some games would have a despawn, but Astroneer is not like that. But it can become very messy and laggy if you put down like a hundred of things on the ground. Alright, we're going to be looking for compound right now. For the tether, tether bundle. Uh, do some uh, research and compound. I wonder what that thing is. What that has. Oh well. Uh, so much compound. This is all I needed too, because we're go we're going to be building uh, different things that are probably going to have this. Yeah, we probably have enough compound. Eight will last, I don't know, however long. How long can I make it last? <coughs> so, let's just look in here. Ah, uh, three resin. That's a lot. Oh well, we don't need any of that stuff right now. So, let's grab tethers right there. Oh, wrong, wrong thing. It's in here. Yep. No, maybe two. Ah, uh, what a good game. Best game out there. I'm gonna see what this is. I may have already checked that, but nothing of value. These are uh, little scrap things. If you watched the last video, they have batteries on them. They can. It's rare. Yeah, I'd, I'd say it's rare. But that's the only real way to do it. And the tractor, the little uh, one of the things that I researched, the tractor. That will help find these things. Usually, what you would do is either put like a wind turbine and a solar panel on it, or a wind turbine and then a battery on it, or if you want to plant it with lots of sun, then a solar panel and a battery on it. You get the you get the point. Although tractors come with their own battery already in it, but it is nice to have two batteries. And they do supply infinite oxygen wherever you are. That's why you need it. Uh, one my oh right, a hole. I actually forgot. Oh, this looks good. Oh, that looks good. Okay. Also, if we could find a hole with lots of research, that would be cool. Sent. Sorry. But then we could. Lots of research from it too, without worrying about suffocating. <coughs> oh, was this a dead end? Hold on. Hopefully not. But it was. This is a dead end, but at the same time, if I keep digging down, we're gonna get to the cave. So, it's not worth it. It's not even worth it. Alright, sorry, I'm back. Uh, see, I downloaded this really big game, right? <coughs> that takes up. 110 gigabytes and my computer well my d drive ran out of uh space so anyway i'm back that took like 10 minutes to figure out but 
Oh well. See, so yeah, I deleted the files from <laughs> the drive and then moved it to recycle bin, but since it was in the recycle bin, it was technically still on the D drive, so then none of the space was actually cleared up. It just, like, moved from one file to another file. So then I had to, like, figure that one out. But, at last, we are back. Okay. So we were looking at that cave. Nothing in it. Okay. Now it's picking up these. Sorry about that. But everything should be normal now. Alright. So this cave, trash. I might as well just cover it up. Go down control. Left click. You have to hold down control and you do have to hold down left click. Perfect. Look at that. Okay. It should be somewhere up here maybe. Yeah, there was a hole all the way over there, but I'm not sure about that. This one looks fine. So. It's okay if it's not perfect. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna put that. Oh my god, please stop. Ugh, okay. It's the real hole. I hate it. I hate how I did that, but. Can't fix anything now. I mean, I can, but. I don't want to. Not worth. Not worth all that. Although I'm gonna do it anyway, aren't I? Uh, later time. So, so that one perfect. The research bin. Well, post. This is really the only cave that's actually a cave. <coughs> so. This is what a cave looks like. It looks pretty cool. But, it's only a cave. And, I won't find any resources down here. Except for the research. And the little mushroom. Which is not actually a resource. Although, down there, <gasps> aluminum, you see that? See those things? That's aluminum. And that is what, that is one of the two resources that we're looking for. But the main one. We're probably going to have to go do that, unless we start digging around and find other stuff. But I doubt we're ever going to do that. So you know what? We're going for it. That is going to be the aluminum one. And it's a shame that it's all the way over here. But aluminum has always been like that. Aluminum is never in a convenient place. And I'm quite happy actually, but I even got to find it. So. I'm gonna do this. In this game, lots building. Also, I've seen people do very amazing projects in this game, which we might do a little bit of, because that will be very fun. Got the whole theme park and everything someone did, blasting off in the rocket, rocket ship with a rover and everything, I don't know. By the way, you, you can fling Stuff like tractors and rovers in the outer space. 
<laughs> it's it's so stupid, but it is possible. I'm a room master. That's a fine. this does become, and that's zinc, right there, that's zinc, but if this becomes a permanent mine, then we should be good to drive anything down here. Alright, that is a research, that is our aluminum. That is zinc, which is a waste of time. That's research. And this is all research. Compound, of course. Alright, now that's about it. Alright, so the way you can tell that something is zinc is it's like a spear. It's like a spear thing with little crystals coming off of it. And it's like a purple. Aluminum. Discs stacked on top of each other <clears throat> and compound a bunch of little balls that are usually gray but in this case it's more of a blue also there's little symbols that's a gray and then it does say compound this would say uh self right yeah not zinc but the only thing you can use it is for is zinc <laughs> So when I say mine, early game, there is no mine. It's just you go down there, take all the resources, and you're done. Resources do not regenerate. If you want more resources, you have to go out and find more. Or go into the later game and actually build a mine with an extractor. Remember that uh, 7,500 bite thing? <coughs> ah, that's a lot. Yeah, that's the extractor. Okay, compound. And when you go into a mine, you're just gonna wanna look around, collect some of these bites. No idea what that is. To be honest, no idea. lots of research, lots of compound. That looks like an enlarged ammonium, which is really weird. What we're looking for is quartz and mostly aluminum, but also quartz. Quartz is a pink thing. It's not these. These are like little organic mushrooms, but quartz is some like pink crystal rods. So, nothing like any of these resources down here. And you're gonna see it because all these resources shine. It should be around here. I don't know what the problem is. But those bites are pretty nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna say it. Oh, oh, it's resin. That's what it is. Okay. <laughs> and the enlarged ammoniums. That looks just like ammonium. It's that color. Oh, when you're already mined it. It's that color. And it's kind of in like a spear. Alright, so no quartz here. But we do have aluminum. And research rocks. Which I'll be stealing one. One out of like the five here. These... I do think are the best out of all the other rocks on the planet, but they're about the same, I think. I think they're only like 500 bytes more, or, uh, no, I think it's like 50 bytes more, so I, I can't remember. Oh well. Again, the harder it is to get something, 
the more valuable it's going to be. And that applies to everything in the game. Everything. Even the resources from the chem lab and all of that stuff. And speaking of which, we're going to need to build one to make progression. Alright, we're probably like 20 minutes in the video. That's what I'm gonna guess. Maybe a little less. So we're gonna have to hurry this up. Tungsten. Ooh. Never mind. Tungsten. Tungsten's on another planet. <laughs> iron. Oh, iron and plastics also on other planets. I think plastic. Hold on. I'm glad this game has a uh, Wikipedia built into it. Usually you would have to look it up online. <coughs> Crafting. Nope. Resources. Must be here. Plastic. Okay, and then you don't say anything. <sighs> yeah, okay, you will have to look it up. I know it's carbon. Yeah. I think it's carbon. Maybe ceramic? Carbon and glass? Yeah, it doesn't matter. Oh, well, it's, it's one of those. Um... I have no idea. So... We are going to... Probably... Yes, yes, that's what we're gonna want. We're going to want a soil centrifuge. This. See how it says one aluminum? Ha ha ha. And have this thing run. Ooh, yeah. It's a uh, pretty big boost. I'd say like by a hundred. It's like a hundred more. Which is not that bad. Ooh, oh my god. Oh. Alright, so. You may be wondering how we get to other planets. Or if you already know this game, you're going to be telling me how to get to other planets. Of course, it's this, right? It's this thing, um, tip, um, with the rocket ships as they go. You're going to want to go from small shuttle, you're going to research this, and then research the large. You're just going to skip over the medium shuttle. There is no point in it. Also, uh, there's probably one more thing. Oh, right, rovers. You're going to go from tractor to large rover and you're also gonna have trailers too tractor trailers that way you don't waste any research also it's just better it's a really good thing let's take uh, huh I, don't, I think I have to, I think we have to go to other planets for that all right well a shuttle does not come with a thruster that is separate, and that costs research. And that's what I'm trying to find. It's going to be in here. This is very annoying. Ah. Okay. So 2,000 bytes in total. After that thing's done researching, we should be fine. One aluminum, one ammonium. And the shuttle takes two ammonium to build. That means in total, just for like a trip, we're gonna be burning one aluminum, one ammonium. And, to set everything up, one aluminum and three ammonium. So, you see how ammonium really, really starts to, uh, really starts to become an important resource, especially for rocket fuel. That's why it's called the rocket fuel source. Nah, that's just what I call it, but it pretty much is. Because, that's pretty much the only thing it's good for. Early game, of course. Later game, it's used in hydrazine. 
Also, hydrazine is a rocket fuel, but can also be built, used for nanocarbon alloy. This feels so wrong. The last time I was doing mining and all this very valuable resource, we were sending up mines. And I'm just destroying the possibility of a mine. Every time I mine one of these, it's like 500 resource. Every time it does the little ping ping pong. That is a resource. And I'm probably dropping them. Correct. Hmm, probably. Oh well, we're gonna find it later. Like I said, they never nothing ever despawns. That was a lot more than five jingles. I only have five of them on me. Oh well. So when we get up here, we're gonna start smelting it. And then I'm gonna take off all the compound. And then I'm gonna put that with the resin. And then we should be good to go. And I don't know if I'm going to sit through it or if I'm just going to skip the video to it being done. Probably sit through it, because we can do a lot more other stuff. Speaking of which, we're going to need another printer. Right. See how much it takes takes up? You're going to need to go on pause. I'm sorry, but you're taking on way too much. And this is why quartz come in handy. Luckily we can soil Sorry about that. Luckily we can soil centrifuge quartz. So we don't necessarily need to go mining. But aluminum we cannot. That is straight from mining only. And I don't really care because it is found on all the planets, little common, isn't overly common. I would not call it a common resource, but, oh well, it's not the uh, most common though. Is that what we want first? I think it is. After this is done, then we can start making a lot of stuff. <coughs> oh no. I'm gonna have to babysit this because I'm gonna have to take off everyone. Alright, I'm gonna make a run for it. Yeah. Also, I did not research the solar panel. I know now we're talking about something like 25 minutes ago, but like 30 minutes ago or something. But that takes copper, and copper is a very, very rare resource. It's only found like in the mountains, on Silva, and on another planet, but, but that's it. And it only gives you like two. And that can be used for other stuff. So we're not going to sacrifice all of that. No, 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 no. Crush me. Yeah, we got really lucky to get all this. See, we got aluminum pretty hard to find. You see, it's nowhere around. Nowhere. It's the only place. But when you do find it, it gives you like 20. Which at least half of this is gonna go in thrusters. Because we are going to be traveling from planet to planet. There's also another thruster. Uh, that actually yeah it does take hydrogen. But you don't need to keep replacing the thruster. That only takes a million. Look at that. And there's still plenty more. 
Once I go up there, we're gonna have to replace that thing. I'm a little sad about the quartz, but I was so close to falling. But it's not the end of the world. That's what I was gonna say. It's probably right here somewhere. Keep looking for it because I'm a, I'm a little desperate. <sighs> oh my god. That is a lot of compound. You see why I don't care about all the compound? Whenever I mine up a compound, I really don't care about it. That's the reason. And it's found on all the planets. Just as much, too. So. I mean, that would be one challenge to try to use up all the compound in the world. <clears throat> but then in the end of the day you can just take one of these little canisters and soil four compounds so I mean it's really an impossible resource to get rid of and it's really stupid too because you don't I mean it's only early game we're already kind of fading away from it a little bit but it will come right back in action when we try making platforms that is when it's used the base building material. Yeah, that, that's why we need another platform. We can make a platform and then put some medium storages on it. That way I do not have to babysit it. For now, I don't care. That's pretty nice. I don't know why I was floating. Maybe that. Yeah, at last we have it. to record. Lock that, please. Oh, I lock that too. Okay. Now, that is what we want. <coughs> and that is what we're going to get. <laughs> so we're gonna need the other platform. And remember, we get soil from mining. The soil. And that can make us like four winter mines. This is really getting annoying. How much to, how much to make it? I'll do anything for it. Alright, three resin. Yeah. I kinda hate that. It shows compound. No well. <laughs> Such a long range. No. Who are you waving to? There's no one even around. Ports are done. You know what that means. Put in this melter. Oh no. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Grab it. I don't know how he's doing this. This is really getting annoying. Okay. What is its problem? What even? This is a new glitch. I've never seen in my life. Okay. Wow. That's really dumb and annoying. But now that has to smelt out. Unless it's there forever. Hopefully not. I wanted to do the quartz next. Oh. Oh, right, more resin. More resin. 
by the looks of it for now. That looks like it's a lot more rare than compound. For whatever reason. It's not too big of an issue though. Because it is still common. But compound. Annoyingly common. It's found everywhere. Quartz can also be used for beacons. Which is really nice. So if I find a nice big ammonium deposit somewhere. And I... I have no idea, like I'm in the middle of nowhere, right? I can just put down a beacon and uh, voila. Also, doesn't resin look like macaroni? Mac and cheese. Pretty sure it does. Unless I forgot what it looks like. wait to get those auto extractors you know what you do you have two rtgs right two of these nice expensive rtgs that you've heard me talking a lot about i cannot wait to get my hands on it <coughs> see th th this is what happens when a pro plays a game they just keep non-stop talking about all the end all the end game stuff anyway all you do is just place it down and it starts mining for you. And that's it. You just gotta attend to it once in a while and you get like 32 resin or something or whatever you want. Ah, stupid thing. And you're probably gonna be doing that, right? Yep, of course you are. Oh. Finally. This is a lot more important. The only real thing that uses them are these research, these research things. They use them the most. Because you don't need anything on the side. Although, you can actually still have them. I mean, it would be nice. But, it doesn't really matter too much. And a uh, printer, I guess. Medium printers, I don't know. Large printers. But at the end, all these things, you can get all destroyed. Hate them. Never want to see them again. See it? Place it right there. Well, tractor, right? Gonna need the small printer. Ha ha ha. Wait. It takes a compound. Mm. Right there. Now we can build lots of smaller things, including that. And that. See? Two aluminum. Oh, I wonder where we'll possibly get aluminum. Wait. Alright, this tractor is probably going to be it. I'm going to try my hardest not to have these videos go past 40 minutes because that's not a good time also uh, i would not want to watch a 40 minute video but now nah, whatever i'm also making a series so who cares looking gorgeous This is the best thing. I remember when I first discovered this. It was the, it was the best thing. Hey, I can't move. I can't move. Someone help. Uh -huh. See how it just collects? I would have had a babysit that. Gotta keep on loading the rope. Alright, you gotta move. Glass. Thank you. Thank you. Thank 
here. Oh, I think. Yeah. All right. And these are going to go on the base and on the tractor. And we're just going to keep sharing the battery. Oh. All of it's going. 